Hello guys, I'm Aluko Shayo Enoch. Welcome to another tutorial session on Create Your Dream World with M-Block or Scratch Programming. In today's section, we shall be taking a look at how to develop a game package like this one. Okay, I tag this game package hide and see game. So let's just take a few minutes to explore the game. When flag click, click me. Okay, so you click the dinosaur to increase your scores okay that's two so just click um okay guys um this is a very cool one um guys do you care to create a cool game like this one then uh let me teach you how to do this okay so let's just get started with crash programming guys okay so let's get started okay so um go to file new Okay, so that's a cool one. So um, this is a blank space. Uh, I can get started with the code to um develop the game. Don't forget, guys. Um, today's session we are taking a look at um how to develop a game package. Um, and the type the title of the game package is hide and seek. Okay, so um the first thing is um I don't like this sprite here, guys. So let me first change this sprite. So you can delete. Then um this is choose a sprite. Choose a sprite. So guys, um, if you observe on that game, we go for something like a dinosaur, okay, the animal. So this is dinosaur. Guys, you can just choose any of the sprites you like here, but I just want to um, develop that game again. So this is a good one though, but this is the dinosaur tree. Okay, so this is the sprite and I'm going to apply all my code to this dinosaur. You can see that the dinosaur tree is um, highlight. Okay, so the first thing is to go to under code. You have costumes, sound, so under code, go to events. Then to initiate the game, you when flag click. You can also do when space bar press, but I prefer this when flag click. Okay, so when I press this flag, there's something will happen to this sprite. Okay, guys. Okay, now um, if you are observant also, um, when you click this sprite, then um, the, you increase on your score. So um, the next thing is just to create um a variable, and we're going to tag the variable um score. So uh, to create a variable, just go to um yeah variable okay so now make a variable okay so let's tag this variable not for us try just for the dinosaur guys so for this sprite only and let's tag that variable points okay so it will increase on your points so okay that's a good one so dinosaur point zero now at this point zero okay so and the next thing is um i'm going to set this point um you said this is set variable okay so just take this now bring it out here so combine this so not set my variable because i already tagged the variable and um, point so i have to change this my variable to points okay so i set point to zero okay so i can increase on my score from here now okay the next thing is that i want this um dinosaur to be able to um move randomly um um within this um, region okay so um the first thing is that i need to let guy call your attention to something in mathematics and uh, you have um coordinates so you have this um this um horizontal line is your x coordinate and um, in scratch or m block the maximum for uh, your x coordinate is 240 and you can see as i'm moving this and, and the minimum is um one eight um minus 240. also for your y axis you have a 180 the minus 180 down so at this point is zero zero now so now let me set um this now to zero zero um so go to um you just go to um motion okay motion is for movement okay then i want to then choose go to x and y so this is a good one so just move this one here okay now um i want it to be um for example let's just take it to zero set x to zero and uh, y to zero okay when flat click see now so zero zero this is um zero comma zero origin now for example let's take um let's assume that i want to set um x to 240 so that to go to the extreme end there let's see what will happen you see now extreme 240 here okay to the right hand side okay if i set um y to um x to minus 240 so it's going to that will be um extreme end here to the left hand side of x coordinates so let's see what happened do you see now so that's what's going on so let me take it back to zero because uh I want it zero guys so origin okay that's a cool one so let's continue with that so the next thing is um i want this some um, dinosaur to go into hiding 
uh, to um then show because this hide and seek game okay so um so uh let's first show okay so um show that will be on the um show guys uh, where is show guys go to look okay so um guys uh, what what am i doing where do i have show guys um show 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 yeah look so let's see um show guys so i, I need this show and hide so let me just bring these two out so i don't need to waste my time okay, because this hide and seek so you need to hide and um show yourself and go into hiding okay so now let's just show okay so what happened this um dinosaur appear here okay and say click me to increase on your point so now since you have to say this so let, then just go to code the code and the code block i need now is to code block to say something okay so show yourself and, and, and talk to me okay so show yourself and talk to me what do you want from me guys okay so show okay you can say um click me to increase on your scores or click click uh, me to increase on your points okay so let's say click click me to increase uh, on your point okay guys that's a cool one what am i typing guys <laughs> okay so sorry about that guys uh, that's uh to increase on your points okay so click to click me to increase on your point now so this dinosaur show itself and ask you to i go to talk to you that click me to increase on your points so let's test that so click me to increase on your points okay so that's a good one okay so then i want this dinosaur to go into hiding and show hide and show hide and show and that will be forever guys so let me bring show let me let me bring that back because i need to show myself again um yes show okay now so i want um hide and show to be forever hide and show forever so now the next um code block i need is forever code block and where do you see forever code block and that should be under control so this is forever and um, forever Okay, this is repeat, but this is forever. So I can go with this now. So forever. So what what I want this part to do forever? Um, I want it to hide for um some minutes and to show itself for some few minutes. So let's say maybe hide for a second or for two seconds, then show yourself for a second or for two seconds. Okay, so now um so now since forever, so let me just uh attach um wait. And so where do I see wait? Um wait should be under um um, um guys, guys, control, guys, let's try control. Should be able to control this right and uh, wait i've seen this okay so this wait so i'm um, show and um wait for two seconds or for a second but i think let's go for two seconds for now so that it will not be too fast so then uh, i still need let me still work with this wait also also wait for um hide for two seconds okay show for two seconds then i hide for two seconds then now uh, this time around because i want this um dinosaur to be able to move with this region randomly so I want random movement now. So for random movement now, um, X and Y coordinates, I want random movement. So then I need a kind of mathematical operator there. So go to operators. Uh, so what kind of operator do I need? I need pick random. Okay, so let's just take a pick random for X and Y coordinates. Okay, now don't forget that um, for X coordinates, you have a maximum of um, 240 and then the minimum of minus 240. Then for Y, you have maximum of 180 and minimum of minus 180. So now, um, for x, let's start with x. Now, but the problem is that if I choose extreme value, I will not be able to see this dinosaur. Some part of the um, of dinosaur will be missing. So then, I, I need not to go for extreme values of x and y coordinates. So let me just choose um, instead of 240, let me choose something like 210 or 220 for my x coordinates. So uh, my x coordinates, let's go for minus 210. Okay, minus 210. Okay, then to plus 210. Okay, then for y coordinates, since I have 180 and minus 180, let's go for something like a minus 160, minus 160, and um, to something like 160. Okay, so then um, I can now, um, that's a cool one. So then um, let me take this for x, is um, this is x. So um, where is my coordinates? I think I moved that. Uh, Okay, so guys, uh, I need to bring um this um go to coordinate out now. That is under motion. I need it again. So um go to X. So I need this now. 
so i want my um my x this is x so just pick this one and put it here um just bring this one down so that we can see what we are doing then my y this is for my y so just um place it here so uh, let's just see what we are doing uh just sorry about that okay let me just move this one up here let's just let's plug in forever here no problem about that okay so now what i want to do now is um you hide and wait okay hide and wait then uh, then hide and wait then um, you can go to this now randomly okay then um after that then you can show yourself now so show should come here now guys all i'm doing <laughs> oh god just move um i don't okay so show should come below guys because you hide first before you can show so um i then you can show yourself here now okay then also wait for two seconds now where is get that where should be where guys control so wait for um two seconds too so let me just change this to two okay so you wait so show and wait for two seconds and that should go forever so i can take everything here now so forever i don't wait um i don't need this one here i'll just bring the eye okay so forever you hide for two seconds then go and um, make this random movement then show and wait for two seconds so i don't need this um wait again so i can drop it so i think uh, my block code is okay then plug this one in your forever okay so forever hide for two seconds go to um this region this, this should be um at least a mistake guys uh, for my y um go to x pick random okay so uh let me just duplicate this because i need two of these so let me duplicate okay um so uh then that's okay then um so you pick randomly minus 220 to um uh, pick randomly okay um this from this is my x okay my x should be my y okay so um this is x here so i want to replace this x with uh minus 220 to 220 um so what's going on here okay sorry about that so pick randomly uh minus 210 to 210 should come to x here so go to um minus 210 to 210 then for y um let me just remove this one now so for why i want the minus 160 to um 160 okay so this is it here so place this one for your y then i don't need all this i don't need this okay so now let's see what we have there now so um go to x pick minus 210 to 210 then y um pick minus um let me just move this one here because something is i can't see okay so everything is okay so go to x uh, minus 210 to 210 then y minus 160 to 160 that's a good one then show wait for two seconds okay let's see what's going to happen to the dinosaur now so let's see what is going on um so click click me to increase all your points then oh wow disappear then i click but you see now when i click and uh, nothing happened to this point the point is not increasing so i need to do something there now so i need to um complete my block code now so the next thing is um let's um when this um sprite is click what should happen so we should change score so now let me just go back to um that should be event so when um sprite click so this is the last code now i can just pause this now okay so when sprite click what do you want to up i want um this um this code to change i want my point to change and so uh, that should be under variable now so a uh, point i want point to change so change this now so but not change my variable because i already created a block variable change point to uh, by one so you increase the point by one okay then also i want a sound when i click this um dinosaur i want something like kind of pop sound so that should be under sound so play sound pop until done yeah cool so that's a good one so i think uh, my game is cool now but now the final thing is to go for my background okay but before i go for the background let's just see what we have here so click whoa so i got it click whoa two catch here click whoa i got it 
Okay, now let's just pause. Finally, I don't like this. It's wide background. So let's do something quite cool. So this one asks me to choose um, a backdrop. So guys, um, what type of backdrop do we go for? Let's go for indoor, outdoor. What do we have in here? No, let's see outdoor background. Yeah. Okay, I'm looking for something scary. Guys, something quite wild, 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 wild. I think I can see something like a mountain here, a uh, mountain cave. Uh, this is a cave. This scary, guys. I look like something quite scary. Let me go for this backdrop, guys. Whoa, this is a cool one. So now I think my game is good. Let's just uh, maximize and let's play. Click me to increase all your points. Okay, I'm ready for you. Where are you, guys? Whoa, I got it. Where are you, guys? Uh, whoa. I got it. Two points. Um, what? What? Can, can I do? What? What is going on now, guys? This, this is a cool game. Hope you guys enjoy this. Um, guys, do well to subscribe to my channel. And um, at this point, let me quickly um pause and um, we call it a day because I need to quickly show you something, guys. And uh, let me just quickly pause. Okay, guys. Uh, make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel. And you can explore more games and uh, more scratch and end block games uh, um, on my um, channel here. Yeah, you can go to my website, scratch.mit.edu, user alukosha, you know, just copy this and you can explore as many games as possible. I'll be uploading more games um, and, and in, in very soon. Okay, guys, do well and take good care of yourself. Um, do have a great day ahead. Make sure you subscribe to my channel and like. Bye-bye, guys. Bye-bye, guys.